If you're looking to run a modded Minecraft server with CurseForge, you've come to the right place. In this video, we'll walk you through installing the CurseForge launcher, creating and customizing your mod pack, exporting it, and finally importing it to your Minecraft server step by step. Let's get to it. CurseForge is the easiest way to manage Minecraft mods and mod packs. You can add and remove mod packs with just a few clicks, use the polished interface, and build your own custom experience. Whether you're playing solo or with friends, this is the best way to go modded. This tutorial is for Sparkto servers, but it will work on other hosting platforms too. Clients from other Minecraft hosting that switch over can save up to 230% on their hosting costs on hardware that's 37% faster. Check the link in the description for more information. So step one, you should install the CurseForge launcher. You should search up CurseForge on Google and open the first link and click download standalone. And when that finishes, open it up and go through the installation process. I already did, so it should open up right away for me. You should be created with a page like this. Just choose Minecraft. And it should ask you for the folder. Just choose the default one. Then over here, click create, name it whatever you want, and make sure to select Forge or Fabric, depending on what you're going to run. Make sure to choose the latest Forge version, and then click create. If you want to add mods from CurseForge right away, just click on your mod pack, click add more content, and then choose the desired mods you want to add. Just going to add these four. Now we should have them right away over here. If you want to add mods locally that you have downloaded, click open folder then go to mods and drag and drop the mods you like installed there you go now it's time to export this mod pack and we need to install forge or fabric first depending on the mod pack versions we chose to install make sure to tick this and back up any important files obviously before doing this now create a mods folder and then we can drag and drop all the mods we just downloaded now we can start our server. Accept the EULA. Your modded server is now ready. If you're facing any issues during startup, please make sure to go to the startup tab and make sure that this slot is empty. And enabling this option can lower your resource consumption a little, especially on modded servers. You can join your modded server using the mod pack we just created by clicking play here and typing in your IP. If you still have any other questions, please submit a ticket. Our team is online 24 seven and we're here to help out whenever. Thank you for watching and have a great rest of your day.